Hi everyone, today we're going to be talking about the different question type options that you have within Google Forms. So the first thing I want to show you is that if you open Google Forms, you'll notice that it's already preset to multiple choice and that's seen right here. But a nice thing about Google is that if you start to type in a question, so maybe my question is, what is your favorite G Suite app? It will usually pick the best question type for your question that you've typed in. So you can see that mine has changed to a short answer because that's the one it thinks um, works best with this question. Now you can be um, the person that picks it. If you go over here to the drop down arrow, you'll notice that there are a lot of options and you can go through and pick whichever one you would like. So there's nice ones where you could type, you, ha you can have people type things out, short answer or paragraph. Um, there's these options like multiple choice, check boxes, or drop down, which are really nice if you want them to pick one or maybe a couple answers. Uh, you can also do a file upload, or they have this section down here, um, which I think works great for standardized testing prep, like MSTEP. So they have linear scale, uh, multiple choice grid, and a checkbox grid. And these allow you to have you know multiple answers, possibly with multiple things going on within a question. And then there's also um, some options for if you want to record the date or time that they're uh, doing this. Um, so once you have that picked out, I'm going to choose, I'm going to go back to that short answer that it picked. Your question is set and you're ready to move on to the next question. I hope you enjoyed this short tutorial on the different question type options that you have within Google Forms.